Let's have some beer. <gasps> what? Be going down, people of the world. My name is Redbeard, and you're watching yet another beer review. Thanks a bunch for joining me. Smash thumbs up in the face, and let's get into it, shall we? For the beer of the today, we've got a bottle of brand new Jelly King variant that Bellwoods out of Toronto released, coming at 5.6%. This is their cranberry and tangerine version. Yeah. Had several variants up to this point, and the most recent one I had was their pomegranate and lime. Far and away, the best I've had. And then they released this one, just new, super new. I uh, got this as well as... Uh, some kind of stout thing and a few cans sorry ha! of a uh, pineapple milk shark so pineapple milkshake IPA they made and I'm quite excited to try that as well and my bottle opener has become invisible it doesn't make any sense to me you know what that's right there I got a beard comb with a built-in bottle opener. Bellwoods. Bell. Gotta show the bones. Gotta show the ball cap. And the... Bam. There we go. Requires a bit. It's kind of weird thing to have a bottle opener on. Requires weird leverage, but it works. I'm using my Uncle Antoine glass because, you know, I just, I like the glass. Wait, there's a... Get a hair on the outside. I saw a hair. I didn't want a big hair on the inside of the damn glass. Let me actually get this in frame. Okay, that looks... Uh, crazy orange. Holy crap. Yes. That is absolutely nuts. Wait. Yeah. Tangerine, cranberry. That's all that's coming off that. And a little bit of that sour funkiness. Let's give this a shot. Yes. That is one of the most beautiful sour hits I've gotten off of a sour beer in quite some time. So many breweries these days are just making like tart beers. Some sour beers I've had, it's like not even. It's like barely even tart. It's just like this has got a super awesome sour kick to it. Mm. Let's do this. Cheers, everybody. I'm honestly like not a huge fan of cranberries on the on their own. Mwah. But just like a lot of other things. When you add them to something. My mom made some muffins recently with some cranberries she cut in half and put in there and they it just added this nice sweet tart kick to the muffins. For whatever reason, them like raw on their own, not a fan. But put them in something, like many other things, in beer. Coffee? Yeah, I'm a fan. And the tangerine melds with that cranberry flavor in a freaking fantastic way. Mmm. That flavor just rides your tongue for like five or six seconds after you drink it. This is delightful. I'm pissed off. because Actually, I bought another bottle. Like with this order I just got from Bellwoods. I bought another bottle of that pomegranate lime sour. Because I liked it so much. And I already drank it. I wish I'd saved it to one-on-one -on -one compare with this. Because this is... I like it. As much, if maybe a bit more. I 
I haven't been failed taste wise by the Jelly King series as of yet. They have yet to make something that I have been like, ah, not really a fan. Everything they made so far has been some haven't been the best, but they've all been pretty damn good. So even the ones that aren't the best are pretty damn good. So this this is like, yeah. And I'm pretty sure date and ingredients are on here because Bellwood does that kind of stuff. Because they're with the I mentioned before. The freaking label is so small on this bottle, but everything you want is there, even a small bit of both, both the beer. Bellwoods for the win. Uh October 14th. Currently 23rd. This is nine days old. That that's that's the fresh beer right there. Jelly King, juicy high drops, uh, dry hopped sour with punchy hop aromatics and tart tropical fruit. But the same thing they say every time. To this batch, we added a healthy dose of cranberry and tangerine for exponential fruit enjoyment. They say that at the same time. They just like change it up. Water, malted barley, wheat, oats, cranberry, tangerine, hops, yeast contains barley, wheat, and oats. Not the yeast contains that. It's the the way it says it, yeah, yeast contains barley, wheat, and oats. No, it, it, it ends. Just oats. 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 I'm not going to lie. This is not my first beer of the evening. It is only my second, though, so... Maybe I should have eaten more today. Because the words... They be the slurring. No bit. Getting more into it, it's it's really good, but that pomegranate lime one was something special. I'm gonna give this a nine point two five. It's damn damn good, damn good. One of my favorite Jelly Kings ever. I'm pretty sure I tend, I tended that pomegranate lime one, so it works out. And if you've had this, let me know in the comments what your thoughts are, because we be. Of the done now. Thumbs up if you liked. Thumbs down if you disliked. Doesn't matter to me. The choice is yours. Subscribe for not subscribe. And want to see more stuff that I do. And smack that bell notification so you're made aware when stuff that I do is aware is available for you to watch. Yeah. Back with something like this pretty freaking soon. Peace out. Gandalf was not impressed with that outro. Probably not impressed by that either.